This is Stacy, and I'm Amanda from BND. Your credit score is a grade you receive. Instead of it being for social studies or biology, it's a grade on how well you manage your finances. While you're in school, your final grade is a combination of your homework, papers, or projects you complete, and your test scores. Your credit score is made up of these components. Credit inquiries. Every time you apply for credit and whether or not you are approved. Open loans. How much money do you owe to banks or credit unions? What is your monthly payment and what is your payment history? Credit cards. Your score includes the number of cards you have, your credit limit, your payment history, how long you've had the card, and the balance on the account. Closed accounts. Even if you close out a card or bank account, it stays on your report for seven years. Collection accounts. If you did not pay a bill and it was turned over to collections, this will become a part of your score. Public records. Items like tax liens, court judgments, driving records, and bankruptcy filings. The three major credit reporting agencies in the U.S., Equifax, TransUnion, and Experian, take all that information and create a credit score for you. They sell that credit score information to other businesses and credit card companies to let them know if you're a good risk for them. You're given a credit rating or score between 300 and 850. According to CreditWise, a credit score between 621 and 700 is average. Over 700 is considered good, and greater than 800 is excellent. Most credit scores fall between 600 and 750. Lower than 621 is considered a below average credit score. Because your score takes into consideration your credit activity and current credit situation, you should periodically review what information each of the reporting agencies has to make sure it's accurate. This information is found in your credit report, which you can request at no cost every 12 months by visiting annualcreditreport.com. You can also purchase your credit score at the same time if you want to know what it is. How do you improve your credit rating? Limit the number of credit cards you have and only apply for credit you need. Avoid maxing out your credit card. And pay your credit cards, bills, and loans on time. Your payment history makes up about one third of your credit score. Establishing and maintaining a long credit history may also help your credit score since it is based on experience over a period of time. Taking out a federal student loan does not require a credit check. As long as you repay it on time, it can help your credit score and your on-time payments can help it too. Learn more about this topic and more when you visit Bank of North Dakota's College Handbook at collegehandbook.bnd.nd.gov.